It's a building that's really never been built before, anything like it. See, this is our first real passive house building. We had to learn how to rethink the details. We had to learn how to rethink the design. The biggest challenge for this project is the height of the space. It is basically a 30 by 30 meter building, 10 meter tall. So the volume is big enough for three floors, but we only have one floor. So bottom line, we had to be three times better than an ordinary passive house would have to be in the same location. The Wood Innovation Research Lab is a research building right next to the Wood Innovation Design Center. And it was built to, well, accommodate research and give us more room to work with our students and on our research projects. Well, personally, I think pretty much every building we build today should be as energy efficient as possible. And Passive House is the leading standard in this category. So the big interest we see recently in Passive House comes from their track record. Um, some larger European studies have shown that Passive House buildings on average perform as they have been designed and that's different from um, other green building rating systems that have had a more mixed result and um, as municipalities owners are looking for some control over the energy performance at the end of the day they got really interested in the passive house standard. The idea is essentially to reduce the energy consumption radically in a ballpark of about 90 percent of your heating and cooling to get away with a much, much smaller system, so basically almost half the building passively working on its own and working for itself. From the ground up, it was a challenge just understanding how we were going to assemble all of the different components for the project and meet passive standards given the you know, end use of the building. If you have the right team and if you have motivated people on board, you can actually pull this off. So it was a pleasure to see that um, neither the contractor, nor the architect, nor the engineer had practical experience with working on Passive House projects just because they were really motivated and wanted to do these kind of things. It actually was a blast to work with them and it worked out very well. It's wonderful to see this uh, building completed. It's our first certified Passive House building and uh, it was a particularly challenging one so it's very rewarding to see that all the efforts came together and the building is here now. Uh, I also think the building has significance far beyond uh, being one pilot project. I hope that this project can um, help the local wood industry to find a market for higher quality products. Um, this building is part of our journey towards using those resources and adding more value to them and before, we, um, before we ship them away. So I'm hoping that uh, this building can be part of that.